everything around us is evolving. With the help of constant updates and maintenance, everything that we know is upgraded to something better to suit our needs. The most common example of this evolution is the smartphone or the computer on which you are watching this video. Three decades ago, there was no sign of smartphones. But as we know now, the entire phone market is ruled by brand new and technologically advanced smartphones. Even now, these smartphones are evolving with constant addition of new upgrades and features. But hey, why are we talking about this? Well, in this video, we're going to talk about something else that has evolved significantly. Most of you might know what exactly web development is. It's the process of developing websites. Web development covers tasks such as web designing, scripting, e-commerce development, network security development, and much more. But do you know that the websites that we use today looked far different than the world's first website, which was published in 1990? Back then, the website was filled with only text and links. With the introduction of new programs and features, web development evolved further and further as the web developers became capable of adding more elements to their websites. Unlike previously when the main focus of web developers was to add as much content on the website as possible, currently the focus is on refining their websites. Today, web developers strive to make their websites look aesthetically pleasing and be interactively smoother than before. The purpose of making the websites interact smoothly is to allow the users to have a much more personalized experience and increase user engagement. An aesthetically pleasing and interactive website helps in ensuring that the contents are fresh and the users are having a positive experience. But how is this massive change being made possible? Why didn't the web developers try making their websites interactive and aesthetically pleasing a decade ago? Well, the answer is simple. It was impossible back then. Back in 1990, when the world's first website was published, only web browser available to the public, namely the line mode browser, was not graphical. Hence, it was not possible to add images to the websites. Two years later, the first image was posted on the internet and then in 1993, the world's first graphical browser was launched under the name of Mosaic. This enabled the various companies around the globe to develop their own websites, with MTV being the first company to successfully publish their own website. But the evolution of web development didn't stop here, as the year 1994 witnessed the launch of one of the world's most famous and popular web browsers, Netscape. This new browser allowed the web developers to add animated GIFs and allowed two important features, namely text formatting and tables. The year 1995 marked the beginning of a new era, the era of interactive content. In this year, the HTML structure and the use of tables to format this structure gained popularity. Furthermore, the popular programming language JavaScript was introduced this year. From 1996 to 1999, several new technologies were introduced, but none were as notable as the cascading style sheets or CSS. The introduction of CSS was the first step towards the separation of content and presentation. Hence, CSS laid the foundation of the web development which is in use today. In the 21st century, several new technologies were developed which allowed the web developers to develop several new generations of useful and immersive websites. After their initial introductions in the previous century, HTML, JavaScript, and CSS went through several upgrades which opened a whole new world to the web designers. The evolution in web development has resulted in it becoming much more personal than it ever was. Thanks to people expressing immense interest in web designing, the web developers have become far more capable and adaptive in the programming field. But you do know that web development is still evolving continuously. With the introduction of WebGL, 3D rendering became a reality. So what's next? Aren't you curious? Do you want to stay on the sidelines and watch this evolution or do you wish to be a part of this evolution? Well, of course, you have to learn web development yourself if you want to contribute to this ever-evolving field of web development. To help you do that, we have a course on front-end web development. In this course, you will learn how to develop an e-commerce website with the help of technologies such as HTML5, CSS3, JavaScript, Bootstrap, and much more. The course will include theoretical study as well as practical coding sessions and we ensure you that you can learn this without having any prior experience with coding. 
If you successfully understand how to develop a website as dynamic as an e-commerce website, you will surely be able to develop any website and hence you can achieve your goal of being a part of this evolution. So why the wait? Click on the link in the description below to learn more about our course. Enroll today and we're sure that you'll enjoy it. This is Skilllink and we'll see you on the next one. Bye.